This video explains the functionality and features of the John Deere E23 transmission in full auto mode, where the operator sets a desired ground speed and the tractor determines the most efficient way to maintain that speed. In full auto mode, the modules available to the operator are max speeds and set speeds. Set speeds can be viewed on the transmission and run pages, but can only be adjusted using the set speed adjusting wheel on the transmission control lever. In the full auto mode, the efficiency manager is always on, meaning the tractor will automatically control the throttle to change engine RPMs. It will upshift or downshift gears to maintain the operator's desired ground speed based on current engine load. Bumping the transmission control lever makes large ground speed changes. Finer speed changes are made using the adjusting wheel. Rapid speed changes are made by holding the transmission lever forward or backward. Operators have the ability to set two separate programmable ground speeds in both forward and reverse. These set speeds are activated by pushing the set speed buttons on the command arm. To change the set speeds, remove the tractor from park and place the transmission control lever into neutral. Then, select one of the set speed buttons. Set speed will become active and indicated on the corner post display. Use the set speed adjusting wheel on the transmission control lever to dial in the desired ground speed. Once the ground speed is determined, move the tractor into gear. When a set speed button has been activated, the efficiency manager will shift gears and change the engine speed to reach the selected ground speed. An outline box will appear on the transmission module to show which speed is active and the efficiency manager indicator light will be visible on the corner post display. Maximum throttle position is required to efficiently reach the desired ground speed. Engine RPMs will increase as the tractor makes automatic adjustments under changing loads. The set speed adjusting wheel can adjust the set speed value while the tractor is in gear. Bumping the transmission control lever forward or backward deactivates the set speeds. Ground speed will then increase or decrease. When shifting between forward and reverse in full auto, the tractor will return to its last known ground speed. Not all modules are available to the operator in full auto mode. Additional John Deere videos are available on how to set up and operate the other transmission modes.